given an equation, two equations like this, and we want to use elimination method in solving this simultaneous equation. We first rewrite the equation. Uh, that is uh, 3x plus 2y equals 5, and uh, 2x plus 3y equals 5. Now we need to checkmate a few things here. Uh, looking at the first equation, we would like to eliminate either x or y. But the condition is like this. Before eliminating any of the variable here, you must check the equation 1 and equation 2 must have the same coefficient. For example, if I want to eliminate, eliminate x, then it means that the coefficient of this x and the coefficient of x in equation 2 must be the same. Now, looking at the equation, you will find that the coefficient of y in equation 1 and the coefficient of y in equation 2, they are not the same. And similarly, the coefficient of x in equation 1 and the coefficient of x in equation 2, they are not also the same. So we need to do a little work on the two equations. We have to multiply the equation 1 by 2. Why am I multiplying it by 2? Because I want to eliminate x. So I'll multiply equation 1 with the coefficient of the equation 2 while I'll multiply equation 2 with the coefficient of equation 1, which happened to be 3. Now, by multiplying equation 1 by 2, we're going to have 6x plus 4y equal to 10. Then by multiplying equation 2 with the coefficient of equation, uh, coefficient of x in equation 1, then we'll have a uh, We'll be having the 6x plus 9y uh, equal 15. This is now our equation 3, and this should be our equation 4. Remember, we are using elimination method. Now, the next step is we will subtract uh, equation 3 from equation 4. Subtracting equation 3 from equation 4. Now it should be 6 minus 6. We have 0. Plus 9 minus 4. We have 5. Y equal to 15 minus 10. We have 5. Okay. So from here we, we are having 5. Y equal to 5. Okay, so we can divide through by 5 by 5. 5 will cancel 5. Hence, we can now say that our y is equal to 1. It means that our y in this very equation is equal to 1. So we substitute y into any of the equation. You get. It can be equation 1, 2, 3, or 4. We're still going to arrive at the same result. So picking equation 1, we are having 3x plus 2y equal 5. So wherever I see uh, y, I'll replace it with 1. So I have 3x plus 2 into 1 close bracket equal 5. So I will have 3x plus 2 equal 5. Collection of like terms. So I'll be having 3x equal to 5 minus 2. So 3x is equal to 3. Dividing through by 3. 3 will cancel 3. So it simply means that my x will be equal to 3 over 3. And 3 divided 3 is equal to 1. Meaning that hence our x is equal to 1 and our y is also equal to 1. And that is it. This is the solution of this very uh, particular simultaneous equation. In case, if this is your first time watching this very video, I encourage you to go to YouTube and subscribe to Usman Chain Physics Maths class. It is free. Follow Usman Chain Physics Maths class on Facebook and TikTok.